Hey, it's Ben Wise. I'm at TLC Fitness tonight. We're talking about the skier. How far should you be from the skier? So each of all these distances that I'm going to be talking about are distances from the flywheel. So you're going to be measuring from the flywheel. Concept two on their website says the ideal position is 18 to 24 inches, depending on your total body size. The bigger you are, the further back you're going to have to be. All right. Uh, so again, when you're thinking about this position, number one, if a lot of people don't ski correctly where they stay very upright, their, their shoulders stay closed off a lot of the time, and they kind of end up in this upright torso position versus actually finishing down through the stroke where your head is almost actually gonna come close to being in line with this monitor, all right? So the first thing that you'll be able to tell if you're too close is that you're gonna feel crowded and that you're like you're almost concerned about hitting your face off the monitor or you're gonna feel like you're claustrophobic, right? So if you're coming in really close and you feel like you are right next to the monitor, that's not ideal. All right, so take a step back. If you go too far back, you'll notice that you feel like all the action is out in front of your body and you're pulling out in front of your body. Your, your torso is all the way forward and you'll start to feel like you're almost falling forward and you're kind of coming up onto your toes, right? And that way you're, you're having a really horizontal, almost like you're pulling the ropes and the handles back into you. And that's definitely not ideal. So. Again, just trying to find that sweet spot of where I don't feel crowded, I'm able to keep my balance, and be able to get a good line of action with the handles. So those are the three things that I would consider. Again, a good recommendation to start out 18, 24 inches, somewhere in that range. Good luck, guys.